The Survey of Petersburg. This plat of survey in Lincoln's own hand shows the detail of the planned towns of Petersburg. The, okay, this plat of survey in Lincoln's own hand shows the detail of the planned town of Petersburg, Illinois. Lincoln laid a stone at this spot to mark the start of the survey. The bronze medallion on this corner commemorates this Lincoln survey point. The survey began in November 1835, about two months after the death of Anne Rutledge. The survey was interrupted by Lincoln's attendance at the state legislature. Legis the survey was interrupted by Lincoln's attendance at the state legislative session in Vandalia, Illinois, during the months of December 1835 and January 1836. Lincoln completed the survey on February 17, 1836 and also surveyed an additional seven blocks just north of the public square for John Bennett. The Petersburg, the Petersburg streets were later renamed. Abraham Lincoln laid out the original 60 blocks of Petersburg, Illinois between November 1835 and February 1836. In 1832, Peter Lukens and George Warburton had laid out a few lots for a new town. Lukens and Warburton played a card game Old Sledge to determine whether the town would be named Petersburg or Georgetown. Lukens won. Both partners sold their stakes in Petersburg within a year. The first detailed survey of the town was undertaken by a young Sangamon County Deputy Surveyor, Abraham Lincoln, in 1835. Since Petersburg afforded better access to the Sangamon River than New Salem, cabins and businesses began to appear in P Petersburg. New Salem was abandoned. The northwest portion of, the Sang of Sangamon County became Menard County in 1839 with Petersburg as the county seat. Lincoln often stayed in Petersburg while riding circuit during the 1840s and 1850s. In 1858, while speaking in Petersburg, Lincoln stated that, he, that his wife insists that he will be a senator and president too. Just think of such a sucker as me as president. Lincoln spoke these words only a few feet away from this familiar spot where he, in debt and without a permanent address, had begun his Petersburg survey. The first, per the first known permanent structure in Petersburg was a cap cabin erected by Peter Lukens in 1832. Lukens used the cabin as a cobbler shop, his own residence, and an inn. This cabin, which later became known as the Bennett Inn, was two blocks south of the start of the Lincoln survey. Lincoln stayed at this cabin while surveying in the Petersburg area. The proprietor was John Bennett, who later built the Menard House across from the public square. John's brother, Dr. Richard E. Bennett, later built his residence on the same lot. After surveying during the day, Lincoln would retire to his room and draft his plats. Lincoln used a drawing board, a T-square, and triangles to lay out the future town. He carefully inked lines, labeled streets, and used a wadded ball of stale bread as an ink blotter.